Hello everybody and welcome back. Hope you guys are doing amazing, hope you're doing fantastic. Super excited to be back with another episode. So for today's episode, nether portals are a big thing. But before that, let's let's get let's get into what I've done so far. So I went ahead and expanded the farm. I found some potatoes, killed a couple of um zombies and got potatoes from which I then went ahead and planted up. Built a little farm thing. I didn't do a time lapse. I'm not gonna show you time lapse on because you already saw me build this one just now. I just, I just want to show you I built another big one for potatoes. We'll build another big one over there, another big one over here and so on and so forth over in that direction as well. Because we still need to do melons, pumpkins and carrots. Don't come with then as well. I have went ahead and built a bridge as you can see behind me, the little bridge arena, which I'm quickly gonna show you in a time lapse. But before then, I'm gonna actually do a dual time lapse. What the hell does that even mean? It means I built two things because I got into it too much, and yeah, the, the, this is the end result. <laughs> but before you know the time, let me just let me well, before I show you it off, I guess, before I show you it off, let, let, let's get into the time lapse. Let, let's just let, let me show you how it went down in the time. Lapse. I'm gonna show both, and yeah, then we'll be back. Okay, so I am um, just probably just showing you the bridge build now. I haven't shown you the portal build yet. I just want to say I think the bridge turned out quite nicely. But again, if you have any ideas, oh yeah, I said put in the pathway in between episodes, as I said I would. Uh, if you you know have any pointers on how I should maybe change the bridge, you know it isn't a diagonal, which is a bit hard to actually build on. Please, please do let me know down in the comments please i can get this whole thing looking amazing because i don't think it looks too bad i think it turned out quite nicely but without further ado let's get into the other time notes of me building the portal so i can show you what today's episode is all about Two builds. Can you believe it? Two time lapses and we're like just in the beginning of the thing. So much progress, so much movement forward in the world that I'm so happy about. Uh, I think I showed up properly. I lit it up again because I went ahead and gathered up some stuff, checked out some stuff and stuff. But I think it turned out quite nicely. A little portal and stuff with a little blue accent because you know why not but yeah so this is going to be our main portal for the entire area i decided against the old tower thing because i think maybe a tower would look cool over there or maybe down here somewhere yeah but I'm, i think this is going to look nice you know so you know the, the pathways and everything okay i wonder where those guys are going they must be must be ready to do something oh there's two more up here we get these guys oh my sound is off there we go now i got sound again bye bye and they're dead yes so we have our little potato farms totally growing with it and our wheat one over here i think they turned out quite nicely oh that's just quickly that's, that's pretty much how i've been getting down and up from there to here faster yes so we did the same kind of wall design here in the background we just didn't give us the same cliff area so we did put more leafage in the areas which is which made me super happy i was gonna ignore them but yes but that is not what the plan is for today today's plan let me kill these guys i'll be right back let's just quick kill them okay as i was saying before before I was rudely interrupted um this farming area and stuff is not today's plan it is actually something i'm just going to continue working on off camera you've already seen me build this one but please let me know if you want to see me build the um others in time lapses and stuff you know just so i know you know uh we're still gonna because uh, what we're gonna do nick because what we are our uh, plan i cannot speak um so our plan is to head over and build another one over here which will house most probably pumpkins another one melons carrots etc so we have everything here and it looks pretty and then we'll start with the windmills and continue on from there with windmills 
skills and everything. I like that. I didn't even take an arrow. I can still be an adventurer. But yes, but that is not for today's episode. As I stated multiple times now. No, today's episode has all to do with this lovely little portal behind me. Because I want to get on the nether roof. I think it's going to be fun. And also, with us being on the nether roof, we will be able to move villagers over from the village at spawn to here. A lot easier because it's a straight shot on the nether roof. Now, naturally, to do this, I we need to, um, you know, first get up there and try and also break a hole in bedrock. Where is my... Where's a cow? Let me quickly find a cow and just quickly cure myself of this. I completely failed. Ow. <laughs> okay. I quickly got rid of everything and stuff. I did fail that MLG jump. That's most probably why I cut. If I didn't cut it, then you must probably saw me fail it. We have everything we should hopefully need for this entire thing. You do not want to know how long it took me to get that. Oh, yeah, I should probably actually also grab my diamond pickaxe. That would be smart. Welcome back to the nether. <laughs> that was dumb, I know, but I did it anyway. Okay, so let's quickly break down this portal because I feel like, you know... Because we're going to link the main one to the roof. So, you know, we need to kind of break this one. I'm just going to break two blocks just in case. I hope that prevents it from, you know, going completely ham. Bye-bye. Okay, so let's quickly hop up here. As you can see by a little ladder, we have been busy. You know, we've definitely been busy. Been sorting out everything, hoping that I got everything right. I do have my friend still. That was the one thing I just realized. Do I have it? Yes. Yeah, so what we have on us is our ender pulls and ladders to get on the roof. Our obsidian and our flint steel to light up the new portal. Some building blocks. Some torches. And we'll see if this TNT maybe hopefully will be enough. Oh, we already have that. Yeah, so this is at... We are facing a block at 127. Let's just... Let me just quickly take a screenshot of that there we go now we know okay now comes the time of truth okay so let's see oh my goodness let's try baby is that the same coordinates i think so so what i'm gonna do is is place a cobblestone like that there we are okay now let's build ourselves a new nether portal this, this looks kind of cool, actually. Yeah, damn, that looks kind of cool. But yeah, so let's quickly build ourselves a new one. I'm not going to do the corners, but I'm going to do it free. Can't really MLG jump in here, can we? <laughs> Light it and let's see if it works. I hope it does. Yes, it does. Let's go. See, uh, yes, it brings us back. Excellent, excellent. Yeah, so what we'll do is we're going to... I'm going to do off camera. I'm going to turn this into the exact same like Tory gate as what we have up top. Let me just quickly pop up here. So I can quickly do that just to prevent stuff from spawning. Okay, now let's see if we can break this one. So if I'm not mistaken, it's a pistol on the block you want to break. Obsidian next to it. Of a trap door and block there with a lever on it, TNT there, and let me quickly just double check and I'll be right back. <laughs> I just double checked and that goes there. We have to rebind our right click. Okay, we're going with you. <laughs> okay, hopefully we do this correctly. So technically what's supposed to happen is we're supposed to flick the lever. Oh yeah, it's you. There you go. Flick the lever, get underneath here and uh, aim at it right there. With the piston. Okay. Wish me luck. This is my. I haven't done this in a while. So wish me luck. <laughs> I think it failed. <laughs> Why did it. What? Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm actually an idiot. Let me grab my stuff. 
Oh no, it's not gonna sync up, is it? Yeah, it didn't sync. No! Oh no! Um, do I have extra in the pulse? So what happened was when I flicked the lever, it freaking closed the trap door. It closed the trap door. And I was so confused by it just now. But it makes sense because it's going to power. Oh, I'm an idiot. I said it double checked. Oh, that sucks. So do we have an extra ender pole lying around? Please tell me we have an extra ender pole. Please. We don't have an extra ender pole. Oh, of course we don't. Why would we have one? Let's quickly run to the warp forest and see if we can't get an ender pole from the enderman that spawned there. Let's see if we can't get our stuff back before it despawns. Oh, and then this blew up the freaking portal. I'm so sad. I'm actually sad. But let me quickly go grab that stuff and I'll be right back. Well, that didn't go to plan. Um, yeah, and it didn't even destroy it. That's the saddest part. And we don't have any more TNT to break this block. What we can do, I guess, is set it up again. So it's like that. There. Well, at least I now understand where it went wrong. It was that the, um, when, when I was underneath here, when I pressed the lever, it activated changing the raptor state to this, but it, I didn't stood up. My guy stood up and that's what killed me. Otherwise, I would have been fine. That's the rest in pepperonis. And then destroy the portal. We just made it super annoying to try and get back. So, yeah. Let's go take care of the nether portal that spawned in. Yeah. We take Take care of this guy. Oh shit. <laughs> That's a big fella. Big guy coming after me. I just want to break this so that nothing will so it won't bring me free. It will bring me to the top. Yeah, but I'll then go ahead and try and break it again because I'll first need to gather up gunpowder again because I am very unlucky when it comes to getting gunpowder, it would seem. Come here, boy. I'm smacking. Ooh, magnum cream. Don't mind if I do? Yeah. But I'm so upset that I died like that. Ah, uh, but I was so stupid because uh, obviously it was going to power that door. It, it was so obvious and yet I was like, nah, nah, what's the worst that could happen? That was the worst that could happen. <laughs> so let's quickly pop up top again and head through the portal back home. There we are. Because we're going to need more gunpowder in order to break that hole. So yeah, we won't be able to progress any further in the nether until I do that. But never fear, because there are still other things that need to be done. So let's quickly plop some of this stuff back in here i just grabbed some random stuff from my chests to wait to help me get through there some of the weirdest stuff i have in my chests <laughs> yeah we're so definitely gonna need to work on that soon okay so put in the balls in here i really went ahead and so crafted a ton of iron enders for the ender dragon fight that we'll most probably be doing next episode actually now i need to actually get one more obsidian i just realized this because i have 19 i need 20 because i need to build two portals why two portals one in the villager place but i think i know where the village i think i remember with i think i did write down the villagers coordinates so and it's in that direction so yes okay so let's quickly now do some math and see where the hell this portal needs to be in order to be in the village so let's quickly go ahead and do that little bit of mafarinos and i'll be right back Okay, so I, we have our heading. We know what's our distance that we must travel. So let's see if we do this, did this correctly. I'm so happy about this Tory game. I think it looks quite nice. I was going through it and another one. And we're going to build the same thing over here. Okay, so we're going to take our torches out. So we need to head towards this direction. Am I right when I say that? Yes, both of them are going down. So it's in this direction. So let's quickly head up. 27, 26. So it should be on this exact block let's go do that we light it and let's see if we did this correctly or not i'm bringing you with me the whole, the whole way through this one <laughs> let's go why the hell did i have to spawn up here okay cool. so now all that we're gonna do is quickly break this portal okay and with the portal broken we can now quickly move it down here so well there we go and then with this we can now let's see if it, it should link up the one on top i hope right yes it did let's go naturally we're, we're gonna break this one down eventually that's why i'm not making it a nice big one and let's just go through it again okay cool beans so yes yeah, so now we can officially start moving villager from here over to our base but naturally for that we are going to need beds because um yeah we're gonna have to build a villager breather because i'm not gonna bring all of them i'm only gonna bring two of them 
Whatever. I'm not, I'm not that mad. I'm not going to bring all... There's actually a lot of villagers in this village. Let's go grab some beds. That was probably the bed that I grabbed when I was here originally. You know, when we spawned in. I keep, I keep forgetting beds can't stack. Like, actually. Let's see if we can't get four white beds. You know, symmetry. You know what? You know why? Why not? Let's see. Okay, this is not that deep. Okay, that's good to know. Hello, Mr. Bed. And that's the final bed. Okay, cool beans. So now... All we're going to do is, is we are going to need to think where we are going to set up our villager breather, our zombification station, as well as how we are going to be, you know, hey, blue eyes. What? You're special. <laughs> You're very special, my dude. <laughs> You're having blue eyes and all. I've never seen a villager with blue eyes. Oh, well, you know, I guess. Yes. Yeah, so we're going to move over the first two villagers and they are going to be set up in a villager breather so let's quickly hop back and actually see where that guy has brown eyes that's kind of cool how they have different color eyes and with the texture pack that i have i love the bedrock that it's this dark color almost like blackstone yeah see we're, we're really not that far that's that's nice very nice because actually i still want to wait to get down in the nether because um yeah there's still stuff we need down there okay so let's see where are we going to be digging out and putting our villagers that is indeed the question that now needs to be asked hmm i don't sound like them thinking so hard i'm thinking that mountain i think this mountain might be a good i like i'm not using my bridge now okay <laughs> Build that thing for a reason yes because we're gonna build our big base over there so i'm thinking yeah why not here so what we'll do is is put it on the ground you know plop some houses on top and over around the tower and, you know make it look beautiful and stuff but inside the mountain i think that's where we'll house them i think that could look kind of nice so i think that's what we're gonna have to do i think we're gonna have to dig out that whole area there and let's just go get rid of this guy because yes i feel like that would be the smartest ploy because then we bring them out from this portal just just take them across in there yeah i think this is a good idea i think this is smart i think this is gonna work so yes i think let me crack on with that and then most probably i'll see you on the next episode yes i'm gonna end it here then we're gonna go into a massive time lapse i'll be digging that out and maybe even moving the villagers over i'm not sure yet but we might move them over as well but yeah guys that's gonna do it for me i'm gonna let my you know future self take over with the digging and the movification you know he's he's gonna do all of that now off camera and stuff i like i'm talking about myself now this way but yeah so then i'm gonna dig so you guys are gonna see you miss probably the time lapse of me digging out this stuff maybe even moving the first two villagers over and yeah that's gonna do it for me then everybody thank you so much for watching if you are new to the channel and you like what you see please hit that subscribe button but if you just enjoy in general please hit that like i really do appreciate it but yeah guys that's gonna do it for me and as always i'll see you all in the next one bye